Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to fix the driver issue when trying to install Windows 7 on a USB. Now my USB is on a USB port which is 3.0 and I'm going to change it to a port which is 2.0. You can also try using a port only 2.0. Now I started the first step to install Windows 7 on my machine. Alright, now I'm installing Windows 7 on my machine. You see, I got this problem. Now, in order to fix this, what you need to do is first of all press cancel, then press S, quit the installation progress. Yeah, what you're going to do next is that you're going to change the USB from one port to another. Now, it's important that you pay attention to what to do next, since we're going to format your hard disk. Uh, by what I mean that you should be careful is that if you choose a wrong hard disk, all the information that you have there will be basically deleted. Although you can recover it back by using a recovery software. Now we click repair your computer. It's now a system recovery option. Now we press use recovery tools that can help and then next. We go to command prompt and we type in disk part. Now we type disk, no sorry, list disk, and there you see uh, my disk. I will choose disk 0 because that is the one I'm going to install Windows 7 on. So I, I type select disk 0 and then I type clean. Your disk number can be different than mine, so be careful with that. Once you've done it, you're going to type create. Partition or primary. Format FS and equals and TFS. And then I want to I want that format to be quick, so I'm going to press space and type in quick. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to format my hard disk into an NTFS. You can choose between NTFS or FAT32. And then of course the option if you want it to be quick or not. Now my hard disk is formatted and we're going to install Windows 7. You can try uh, just to change the USB port without uh, the need of formatting your hard disk and see if that works. Like I said before, my USB was connected to a 3.0 port and changed it to a 2.0 port, but you can just try it to see if it was only with 2.0 port. Now well, let's close it. Install now. Yeah, and that's about it. I hope this was helpful for you. And uh, yeah, take care. Bye.